Hi, my name's Mark Heath and welcome to my course, Azure Functions Fundamentals. I work as a software architect and senior developer at NICE Systems, where I'm currently helping to create Azure-based digital evidence management systems for the police. Now, Azure Functions is a brand new addition to the Azure platform, and it opens the door to a new style of programming known as serverless. And this allows you to move rapidly, to be able to scale with ease, and to keep your costs to a minimum. And in this course, I'm going to explain what Azure Functions is intended for, why you might want to use it, and we're going to see loads of demos of how simple it is to create your own functions. Some of the major topics that we'll cover include working with both c -sharp and JavaScript functions. We'll use many of the different trigger and binding types supported by Azure Functions, including monitoring queues, working with blob storage, and sending emails. And we'll also see how you can develop in Visual Studio or from the command line with a text editor if you prefer. And we'll learn how to automate deployments as well as how to debug and monitor our functions. And by the end of this course, you'll be ready to create, deploy and manage your own Azure Functions applications. And I also hope that you'll have lots of ideas for how you can incorporate them into your own cloud-based applications, as I think they're applicable in a very wide range of scenarios. And you'll be able to follow along with this course even if you've never used Azure before. And although I'll be using c -sharp and JavaScript for most of the function demos, you can actually use several different languages to create Azure Functions. So much of what we'll be learning is relevant whichever your language of preference is. So I hope you'll join me on this journey to learn about Azure Functions with the Azure Functions Fundamentals course at Pluralsight.